Hello everyone and welcome to another video here on the Cycling Dane YouTube channel and of course about the Giro d'Italia and here on the final stage of the time trial Inter Milan we had a few weird instances we had Filippo Ghana puncturing that was the first thing but still managing to come out on top and we also saw that weird incident with Matteo Sobrero nearly being taken out by the Groupama FDJ car, which was absolutely crazy as he was catching his Miniman, but the car hadn't moved out of the way, which I think was just incredible to see. But what we're also going to just have a bit of a look at is that crash from Remy Cavagna. Remy Cavagna, of course, took a bit of confidence, you must think, from seeing uh, Filippo Ghana having a bit of trouble, to say the least, with that puncture. And a puncture, how much time does that take out? maybe 15 seconds thereabout so it's not only the puncture changing the bike it's also the fact that you're coming from on the limit and then going straight away to a stop and then having to get back into that momentum so great shame for Filippo Gana, but still came out on top but if we bring the clip up here we can see Remy Cavagna just overcooks it a bit and can't quite hit the brakes enough so he's come in with too much speed into that corner and that kind of propelled him onto the barrier but uh, Remy Cavagna still managed to record the quickest time, well, second quickest time on the day. So quite a feat from the national French time trial champion. And he was looking to upset the favorite Philippe Ghana on this occasion, but it didn't quite happen. And he couldn't quite repeat his uh, performance in the Tour de Romandie that he did before already uh, this year. So a bit of a shame for Remy Cavagna and a bit of a shame for Matteo Sobro as well and also Filippo Ghana but what a crazy finish to this stage that's it for this video thank you as always for watching and if you haven't already make sure to subscribe to the channel as we just reached over 10,000 subscribers and I have promised to shave the beard and I will do that tomorrow so thank you all for watching and we'll see you again very soon indeed